Hello. We're going to bother some birds here and um, I've got the same untidy bucket, but I'll put it close to you so you can watch them hop around in there. You will probably get to see how good they are at flying. Yes, we have one in the tub already. Well, is that where you want to be? Let me know if um, watching me trim their feathers is something you'd want to see. Probably record it anyway. Yes, you are all very good at this now. You're basically adults. The bucket is not going to hold you. Sorry, friends. There's there's a quail in the tub. So it's only three days later. Do you see that? You see that? I'm just going to have a bathroom full of quail. Chirp, 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 chirp. Be in the bucket, please. It's only three days later from when I first cleaned, the most recently cleaned this one. Uh, and I thought I could go a week, but I really should have done this yesterday. Four days later. Well, everybody's learning to fly. <laughs> My goodness. Goodness, goodness, goodness. All right, everybody. Mm, please behave. Where'd you go? Oh, here you are. Come here. Sorry. I know, it's terrible, isn't it? You hear that actual crowing type of sound. That doesn't mean that this one's crowing or that it's a rooster. That means that they are wondering where their friends are. Because you landed in the tub and I decided to let you be there. So, just going to try and hurry up and do this. And then maybe tomorrow we'll do a wing trimming. Yes, you landed in the tub. Your friends are in the bucket, but you decided to leave the bucket. So, yes, as they get bigger, they get a lot messier. But a couple times a week still isn't bad. There is gunk stuck to the sides here. says tools, even though it's quail. All right, we've got, I just left everything up here this time. <laughs> Stay there, guys. Okay, they say don't use glossy. Kind of makes sense. I don't, don't want to get no gross anyway. Pittsburgh sales flyers in there. Yeah, the usual ones that come in the mail. And then we got. That's what I'm using. You can use pine shavings, just don't use cedar. I get another bag downstairs, so it's not a big deal. It's what I get for the cats anyway. Are you sad and lonely and getting louder about it? Would you like to come out here? No. Okay. Um. All right. This goes back like this. I'm gonna dump this. My, you have a voice about being lonely. As you can see, they end up being quite not okay with being alone. <sighs> quite not okay. Can I catch you? Gotcha. This is the big one. 
the biggest, who ended up in the bathtub, and I just let them. There. Be in there for a moment, you crazy. Yeah, you can fly. Good job. Whew. All right. Um, I don't think the thermometer's that needed anymore. Plus, it's getting gross and needs some more cleaning. Needs cleaned. This is what I've been doing for their water now, because they do get bedding in it. You're still lonely. I know. It's terrible, isn't it, little bird? Oh, I forgot to bring up the... It would be a video of mine if I didn't forget something. I forgot to bring up their water. You ready? Here, let's get you a friend or two. There you go. You can chill out now. You're the friendliest. Look, who could the friendliest baby? So friendliest. Also one of the smallest. Come here, you. I wonder if the feistiness is like a certain maturity level. Or if you're just naturally feisty. Alright, well. Whew. Only thing left is to, um. Holy cow. Is to take their waste outside and maybe sweep up the floor a little bit because I missed a little bit. Uh, but you can now hear lonely bird squawk. That's a specific sound. And you got to watch them get cleaned up again. Real quick little operation. I would just prefer them to not be on the floor for it because it's a lot of bending over. So, yay! Um, yeah, I'm probably going to trim their feathers because my goal is to have them out, be able to have little fenced in areas out in the garden uh, and be able to help me clean up ticks and stuff. Uh, so in order to be able to do that, they need to not be able to get that far away from me as these ones just did and you watched happen. So we'll try it soon, I guess. Feel free to like, share, subscribe. Uh, check out my playlist section for the entire playlist of the existence of these quails. And uh, this is my very first time with quails, so it's all super interesting. I've done a lot of research, but it's also a very new experience for me personally. So I, I hope you're enjoying following along with my learning. Thanks. Take care. Bye.